What is up guys, Daddy Gamer Fred here, back again with another Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Pokemon Let's Go Eevee news update video. And like clockwork with the brand new movie Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution, there's a brand new video game tied in distribution for the people who pre-booked their tickets. This information was leaked from Coral Coral, but of course, I'm getting my information from Sarahbeat.net. Like always, links to the site, the YouTube, and the Twitter are linked in the description. Now coming from Sarahbeat, it says Pokemon the movie Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution distribution first details from Coral Coral has started to leak and have detailed the pre-booking distribution for the movie Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution in Japan. As with the past years, when you pre-book your ticket starting April 12th, you receive a serial code to obtain a Pokemon. With this movie, you receive a serial code to download Mewtwo to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. It will have the CP of 10,000 and we expect pictures and further details as soon as possible, so keep checking back. Our event databases has been updated with the details of this event again shout out to joe and everybody over there at cerebi the links to this article and the youtube and twitter and all that good stuff will be in the description so first obviously this is coming from coral coral a japanese magazine so this will be a japanese exclusive event however it's kind of new in uncharted waters due to the fact that the switch is region free but players who are looking to grab this me too event will still have to pre-book a ticket to see the movie in order to get a code so i'm unsure if you're going to be able to pre-book a ticket outside of the Japanese region. So you might have to go through that or maybe you know somebody who can maybe hand you over a code. But do note, I'm unsure anyway if you can even enter the code if you don't have a Japanese copy of the game or a Japanese download copy of the game. Either way, that is still uncharted waters yet because this is technically the first serial code distribution that we're getting for the Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee games and as well as the first serial code distribution that we're getting on the Nintendo Switch. With that being said, we usually get to see an equivalent event when the movie releases on the US or other parts of the world with the event being distributed at GameStop usually around the time of the movie. But that might be a year from now because that's usually the cycle of the Pokemon movies. Japanese territories get it first and then it's brought over translated and then the US usually sees it from six months to a year after the original release. Which might sound kind of weird considering the fact that we already had Pokemon Sword and Shield already by that time. But then again, seeing that all last year during the year of the legendary distribution being available for the original Pokemon Sun and Moon games were being given out and the Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon games were out as well. Even now with the shiny Tapus being distributed even well after Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee are released. Currently, we do not know the moveset of Mewtwo. So we don't know if this is going to be adding an exclusive move or anything thing which I highly doubt due to the fact that Let's Go is not really having a competitive scene and the only real reason this event could be interesting at all to people who already caught Mewtwo inside of the game is potentially that this is a chance to grab another Mewtwo. The reason why I'm curious to see if they're going to introduce a special move for Mewtwo because if Mewtwo is not catchable in Pokemon Sword and Shield with the rumors and everything being armored Mewtwo being in the game probably he would be but unless they introduce Pokemon Bank or another way to transfer Pokemon from Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu or Let's Go Eevee or even Pokemon Go over to Sword and Shield, this may be a way to have secured a second Mewtwo and a way for them to, you know, give Mewtwo an exclusive move that you can bring over to Sword and Shield and, you know, that would be more valuable for Mewtwo to have in those games, respectively. So, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Like always, guys, this is in the discussion video. I want to hear from from you guys in the comment section below as you guys know i answer all comments let me know what you think about this coral coral leak as always once we get new information i will be doing a video covering it here so please hit that subscribe button if you want to keep up to date with the latest news peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one like always guys i'm daddy i'm fred on instagram and twitter and you guys can bring the conversation there i'm the american gamer in switzerland right here on youtube and yes i'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one so if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one